No, you're oh, left well, again. Oh! I thought this was the head of the... <laughs> to help demonstrate how to properly echelon. So if we are looking like this, this is us, this is uh, the riders, and the girls are gonna demonstrate how to echelon properly when the wind is coming from the left side. So Lisa has the wind with her wind sticks and now girls let's demonstrate how you would properly go through the echelon. See they're pulling off into the wind so if the wind's coming from the left you're pulling off into the left. Get your hand in there. And then they would continue on this way. And you see how tight they're keeping the cookies? <laughs> this is very important. So if we are out training and we're just double pace lining it so we're not continuously changing, um, the lead riders are going to always make sure if the one's pulling off into traffic, you're going to take a look to see if there's a car. If not, you're going to pull off. Make sure you don't overlap the wheel of the people in front of you. Another thing to add to the double pace lining, sometimes if there's a lot of heavy traffic on this side and there's a bigger um, bigger bike lane, you can, both of you, pull off this way and then drop back. But also, another style of doing, if you don't want to be next to the same person to that ride, you can do the Bulbatory style of ride, where you do a double and then these ones come up like this. Yeah. Hello, new person. Yeah. Because often Tiffany doesn't like to be next to the same person longer than 30 People minutes. Will be next to me. <laughs> I don't think we confused you worse, but that happens when you're doing cookies and face lining. No, let's eat them. So, can we eat them now?